we are going down to Clayton today and we are going the whole way. We're not stopping halfway, but it is a barn burner. It is so humid and hot, but there's a ton of people on the greenway. Hey, and it's such a great day. So much to be thankful for. But yeah, so we're going down to Clayton and yeah. Pretty cool it is exactly 26 miles to right here at the end of clayton but it looks like they might add a tunnel to it so maybe they might start extending the greenway which would be pretty cool get some extra miles in but yeah so i realized in the last video i told you guys that work was donating a dollar to anyone that was walking running or riding but i didn't say to what so work is donating a dollar my ceo is donating a dollar for every mile to inequality in our communities and i think that's fantastic it's putting your money where your mouth is, and I encourage not just everyone at work, but everyone everywhere to donate to something, to put your time towards something, to do good in this world. There's already enough bad. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm very proud of the company for its stand on, on equality and being against inequality. So it's a great time now. I guess it's time to head back. That wasn't even a full two hours to get down here. It looks like it was about an hour and 36 minutes. So time to find a little bit longer route home. So let's get to it. Good evening. So today we are trying to get acclimated to the heat. The past week or so I've been doing mixed inside and outside. I've been trying to do more inside because it's so boring. So I'm just trying to put myself mentally to where if I get to a bad place, it's not that bad. But we all know that once you get to that bad place, it's really hard to come out of. You hit that wall, then you just gotta keep pedaling till you get past. But now we gotta start trying to get acclimated to the heat. And that sucks. And then next weekend, we are going camping. So that will be exciting. Hey. So we are getting acclimated also for Manduro and any adventure rides. I reached out to Leo Wilcox. Cyclist, and I'm here to answer your questions. There you go. <laughs> who is a beast. She holds records and stuff for, I think the Great Divide for women and everything. And she's trying to do it for overall too. She's a beast. I was asking her for training, if it's better to do quantity or quality. And I don't know her, but she, I could imagine her saying this. She was like, well, I just do whatever I feel like. Some people I know do do structure, but I just do what my legs feel like and climb lots of hills. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna ride till we feel like it and do hills. <laughs> well, because the heat keeps increasing, this hair needs to decrease, so we are going to be removing the mop top. So next time you see me, it will be no more mop top.